Hi, boys and girls. Welcome back to Mr. Teddy's Free K. Today, we're going to talk about making friends. When you go to pre-K or kindergarten next year, you're going to meet some new people. Some people that might not always be happy. They might be sad or grumpy or lonely. Let's talk about what to do if you want to make a new friend, but it seems hard. This story is called Grumpy Cat. And on the front cover, I see a big cat. You see his eyes? He looks either angry or grumpy. And I also see a little bitty kitty looking up at him. Do you see the little kitten down here? The title is Grumpy Cat. Who do you think is the grumpy cat? Is it this big cat or is it this little kitten? Let's read Grumpy Cat by Britta Tickentrup. And let's see what happens and if we can learn anything about making friends next year when you go to school. Once there was a cat that lived all alone. He ate on his own, he slept on his own, and he spent every day alone. Do you see him there? He's right by some garbage can. And he's alone. Do you know what alone means? It means all by himself. And he's very grumpy. Look at his face. His eyes are kind of down. He doesn't look happy, does he? At night, the other cats in the playground would play together. Cat wanted to join in, but he didn't know how. There's Cat. And do you see the other cats playing and having fun at night? He wants to join them. He wants to be a part of the fun, but he doesn't know how. If you want to play with some friends next year in pre-K or kindergarten, but you don't know how, what could you do? Let's see what Grumpy Cat does and if he learns how to make friends. One night, everything changed. There was a terrible thunderstorm. Do you see those lines? That's showing it's raining. It's raining on Cat. He looked for shelter from the storm. That means he's looking somewhere to be safe and dry. Poor Cat. He got wetter, colder, and soggier than ever. Soggy means you're just all wet and you feel yuck. He's definitely grumpy, isn't he? Then, suddenly, out of nowhere, there came a meow. Do you see the little kitten? Oh my, kitten was wet and cold, just like cat. Meow, said kitten. Cat didn't know what to do. Look at his face. He's already grumpy. He's already unhappy because of all the rain and he's by himself. And now this little kitten has appeared. What's going to happen next? The rain stopped. Kitten meowed again. Do you see her? She's talking to Cat. She thought she found a friend. But Cat just glared at Kitten and walked away. Glared means kind of stare rudely. And then he walked away. Hmm, what do you think Kitten's going to do? Do you think the little kitten is going to follow Cat or walk away? Let's see. Kitten followed Cat. Do you see the little kitten? She rolled on her back and she showed her belly. She wiggled her tail under Cat's nose. She wanted to be friendly, but Cat, he's still grumpy. Do you see her trying to be his friend? She's talking to him. She touched him. She's trying to make friends. Cat tried his best to lose Kitten by balancing on a high picket fence, but look, it didn't work. Cat is still right behind him. Cat's not, or Kitten is not giving up, is she? She's going to keep trying to make friends. Cat 
thought he finally lost Kitten in a tall tree. But then he heard, you see the little kitten down there? And Grumpy Cat's trying to get away by going up a tree. Is it going to work? Is Kitten going to go away? Or is Kitten going to keep trying? Let's see. Kitten followed Cat up that tree, and she tried to reach him on the thinnest branch. Uh-oh. If you're up high in a tree, and the branch is very skinny and small, what might happen? It says, then kitten slipped. That means fell. What is going to happen? What do you predict? Oh dear, quick as a flash, cat leapt over and took kitten gently by the scruff. That's the fur on the back of her neck. And cat carried kitten down safely. Wow, what just happened here, my friends? What happened? Did Cat save Kitten? Let's see. Kitten meowed. She was happy and hungry. Cat dashed off and came back with a big fish. Look at that. Cat came back with a fish to feed the hungry kitten. Now what has changed here, my friends? Remember, Grumpy Cat didn't want kitten around but now grumpy cat saved the kitten and is sharing food with her are they becoming friends let's see they cuddled up for a snooze they each had found a friend and cat was never grumpy again well almost never look at cat's face do you see cat has a smile and so does Kitten. They became friends. When you go to school next year to pre-K or kindergarten, if you want to meet new friends, don't give up. First, look at them, talk to them, say something, maybe tap tap on their shoulder to get their attention and ask them, would you like to play with me? And if they don't answer or they look grumpy, like grumpy cat, don't give up. Try again. That's how you make friends, everybody. You talk, you look at your friend, say their name if you know it, and just a soft little tap tap to get their attention. Good job, friends. Grumpy Cat.